Walking is good for every part of your health, whether it's mental health and your ability to sleep at the end of the day, whether it's physical health and you getting leaner and more you know, uh, and fitter. Uh, and fitness obviously comes with cardiovascular benefits because your heart doesn't have to work so hard. Your body is much more efficient. Uh, a lot of heart patients, their hearts weaken. When their heart weakens, their heart can't do the same amount of work and the body remains as demanding as before. But if you're fit, your body is less demanding. It doesn't need that much uh, blood or oxygen every second of the, of the day because the muscles are efficient. They can uh, do much more with much less blood. So one of the big things that you're going to get from walking is making your body fit and able to tolerate much less blood uh, supply. Uh, so as a heart patient, that's quite important. I don't think there are very many people who are busier than an interventional cardiologist. And I've managed to do this, and so has my other interventional colleague uh, that works with us, Dr. Ngunga. And what we do is we try and make sure that we sleep early, wake up early, and that we are ready at any moment to go and do the walking. Um, once you've gotten comfortable walking upstairs and make that a deliberate part of your exercise, once you've got the appropriate footwear, then walking is no longer a, a, a reason to be uncomfortable. If you're going to plan to eat, factor in when you're going to walk around that eating schedule. You either walk before or two hours after, one and a half hours after eating. But try and figure out when in the day you're going to walk. And if you don't have a dedicated schedule and you only have 15 minutes in between clinic and, and the ward or uh, between two patients, then use that 15 minutes because you've already got your appropriate footwear to take off, go away, be alone with your thoughts, spend 15 minutes walking you come back, you only have another 15 minutes of walking left to do in the day and you'll find another 15 minutes. The heart clinic at the Aga Khan Hospital noticed that a lot of our patients were not able to meet their exercise demands. And we had a discussion with the leadership of the institution and developed a relationship with the sports club next door, the Aga Khan Hospital Sports Club. And what we've done is we've agreed that at least once a week we'll all convene and walk as a group different rates at different speeds but everyone will meet and walk and it's great because it allows us to reconnect with our friends spend some time networking meeting people that we haven't necessarily had the opportunity to meet um, a lot of people who want to meet me know that on a tuesday i'll be here on this on the field and they'll actually come and look for me on average we've probably got about 200 people on our whatsapp group on average we have between 30 and 40 people at any given moment um, uh, attending the walk and the walk starts between five o'clock and seven o'clock so probably we have about 50 people walking from different parts of the the hospital and a few patients joining us as well but we're expecting this to grow because uh, the in institution is much bigger than that and all of us deserve to incorporate this within our lifestyles